Hello everyone, today we're going to talk about a Bluetooth speaker. Uh, usually there's not too much that's exciting about Bluetooth speakers. There's quite a few to choose from and a variety of shapes and sizes, but I think this one's actually kind of worthy of talking about. It's the Echo Gear Echo XBT right here. And what's unusual about it is that it's a very good sounding speaker, completely Bluetooth, and it's completely waterproof to the point, as we'll see, that it'll float. So don't know if you have a need for a floating speaker, but you probably do have a need for a great sounding uh, Bluetooth speaker that you can drop without too much concern. You can charge up and play for 10 hours and really just take it any place you want to go. So we're going to look at the speaker and compare it to the few others that are out there and, and show you how this thing actually performs. Okay, again, there's a lot of competition in the market for these Bluetooth speakers. One of the best is the, the uh, Monster iClarity HD. It's about anywhere from 50 to 75 American dollars, but it sounds very good. Um, so at that price point, it's tough to beat. And then you have something like the Philips Shockbox, which is uh, considerably more expensive, but it has some uh, also uh, neat features of the fact that it can be turned in on and off just by uh, a move of your hand. But to me, both of them suffer compared to the uh, Echo Gear, uh, Echo XBT. So in, in the spirit of Christmas, let's play some Christmas music and uh, see how it sounds. So the first thing to notice... is that it has lots of volume. So this is a speaker you can take outside even though it's roughly about the size of your hand and you can fill up your yard or whatever you're doing outside and really have good sound, good sound volume. The actual sound performance is also very good. Uh, of course it doesn't have a subwoofer, first of all you're not going to get real deep bass but it, it sounds pretty good and it, it, it to me it, it sounds at least as good as the other two uh, very worthy speakers that we talked about but the thing that I like the best about it is how durable and how rugged this thing is. You don't have to worry about it if you're outside and it starts to rain. If you're looking for a speaker for your golf cart, it's perfect for that because you know it could fall out while you're driving and still keep on ticking. So let's look at it in the water performance and see how it sounds when it's floating. Okay, I promised water and here you have it. Now I'd prefer to throw it in a swimming pool outside but it's December and it's nearly midnight so you're going to have to settle for a, a sink of water. So again, there it is, plain in water. So again, a feature that most Bluetooth speakers won't have, not only is it weather resistant, so if you get caught in the rain, it's not a big deal, but if you have it on your deck and it happens to fall into your swimming pool, no big deal. Okay, so you've seen the Echo XBT uh, plane while it's floating in water. Uh, it also works with a speakerphone. Now, I don't know how that works if you're if you have it floating in water, but uh, let's just assume that it, it does work. <laughs> it uh, it also supplies about 10 hours of battery life uh, with its uh, rechargeable battery. The Bluetooth range is probably about 50 feet, and the speaker itself is six watts of power. So. Again, I would prefer a little bit more power, perhaps, but it, it is pretty good for, for, for the size and its ability. Um, now, in terms of size, it, it's small enough I can stick it in my backpack and I travel with it. Uh, I've actually almost circled the globe with the speaker, so uh, it is easy enough to, uh, to pack and travel with, although you wouldn't want it any bigger. Um, but for, for my purposes, and probably for anyone who spends a lot of time outdoors, this is the perfect Bluetooth speaker. So this holiday season, Here's one to, to think about. The Echo XBT by Echo Gear.